Hello and welcome to Daily Prepare. Today we bring to you a video on prelim specific current affairs. Today we dive into the intriguing world of deputy chief ministers in Indian states. Let's jump into the details. In the dynamic landscape of Indian politics, the appointment of deputy chief ministers is a common occurrence. Typically, this decision arises either in the formation of coalition governments or when no single leader holds undisputed authority within the ruling party. As of now, four out of the five states that recently went to polls in November, Madhya Pradesh, Rajasthan, Telangana and Chhattisgarh, boast the presence of deputy chief ministers. Interestingly, with the exception of Tamil Nadu and Kerala, all major states in India have embraced this political position. The constitutional landscape, as outlined in Article 163.1, establishes the existence of a council of ministers with the chief minister leading and advising the governor. It's noteworthy that while the constitution acknowledges the council of ministers, it doesn't explicitly mention the position of deputy chief minister. Functionally, the role of deputy chief minister is considered equivalent in rank to that of a cabinet minister at the state level. The individual holding this position enjoys the same pay and perks as a cabinet minister. Currently, at least 13 states, including Bihar, have appointed deputy chief ministers. Andhra Pradesh leads the pack with Chief Minister Y.S. Jagan Mohan Reddy appointing five deputy chief ministers. Looking back, Anugrah Narayan Sinha is often credited as one of the first deputy chief ministers in India. The momentum for this practice picked up after the decline of Congress's near-total dominance in national politics post-1967. Instances of deputy chief ministers date back to 1967 in various states. For example, Ram Prakash Gupta in Uttar Pradesh, Virendra Kumar Saklecha in Madhya Pradesh and Chaudhary Chand Ram in Haryana were pioneers in this role. Bihar has seen notable figures like Karpuri Thakur, Jagdev Prasad and Ram Jaipal Singh, yet occupying this position. Shifting our focus to the national level, India has witnessed the presence of deputy prime ministers, including stalwarts like Sardar Vallabhbhai Patel, Morarji Desai, Charan Singh, Devi Lal and Lal Krishna Advani. Legal challenges were posed to the position, with the Supreme Court upholding Devi Lal's appointment in the case of K. M. Sharma v. Devi Lal and O. R. S. 1990, clarifying that the title doesn't confer additional powers. And there you have it. Insights into the role of deputy chief ministers in Indian states and a glimpse into historical precedents. If you found the video insightful, make sure to like, share and subscribe for more such insightful content. You can also download the PDF of this article from the link given in the description below. Stay informed and stay engaged in these critical issues.